I was born into a pastor's home and a home where my parents worshipped, and I was exposed to that from a very early age. Um, actually, before I was born, my mom had a complicated twin pregnancy, and the advice of the doctors was to abort me because my twin hadn't survived. And uh, they decided to speak life and declare promise over me. And here I am, 40 years later, um, worshiping the Lord and continuing to walk in that promise. I just, in my teen years, discovered this passion for worship that um, has just stuck with me. I just cannot get enough of the presence of God. I love leading other people into the presence of God. And from the age of 21, I've been a worship pastor and have had the honor of leading worship all over the world. I began songwriting in my early 20s, and it was really my husband Scott and I that would write and we would sing the songs in our church. And um, I would always get the question, when are you gonna record an album? And I never set out to be a recording artist, but it was in my heart to do something, but I knew it needed to be at the right time and with the right team. And it wasn't until my mid 30s, um, and back in 2014, where the Lord opened up a miraculous opportunity for Scott and I to begin traveling to Nashville to songwrite. And with the best of the best, we were just um, launched into this amazing season of songwriting that really developed me and propelled me forward. And it was in that season that the songs for my first album, You Are With Us, were written and in 2016 I was able to record those songs on my very first album. Um, God blessed that process, the album did really well and I would say that is really the season um, where I knew that writing and releasing music was part of my call and destiny. Since my last recording, so much has happened. We have launched a global ministry, uh, my husband and I called Awaken. We've relocated our family to Nashville, Tennessee, and I've been very intentional to continue on this journey of songwriting, building community and connection, and God has been so faithful in all of the transitions that we've been through to uh, deepen my faith, to continue to stir up the giftings within me, and I've tried to be as obedient as I possibly can to walk in those gifts, and uh, for this new album, I'm so excited uh, that these songs are truly going to reflect the depth of what God has done in us and through us over these last five years. Right now, I'm very intentionally writing towards this album with the best of the best songwriters. And the theme that God is stirring in my heart is unwavering faith. And the goal is to record it in the state of Washington, which is where I was born and raised. And God has blessed us with amazing ministry partners there and I've been surrounded with an incredible team, including a Grammy award-winning producer, phenomenal musicians, a talented vocal and tech team, and I'm so excited to bring all of these amazing people together for this because I know that it's also gonna pull the best out of me and the best out of these songs. So I am asking everyone watching and listening to this to just prayerfully consider um, the amount that you could sow into this to help us achieve this goal. I believe this is worth sowing into because I believe that these songs are gonna reach hundreds and thousands of people and minister to them and bless them with the message of the gospel and unwavering faith. So would you join me in this journey? Would you join me in this venture? And would you prayerfully consider sowing into this album?